Okay, there's a, a nice mattress there. I haven't checked it for lice, but I know, not, maybe you'll be alright. Breathe. At least we're getting it on camera. Make a nice memory. Hey, thanks for checking in, I'm Bath Top Sir, and welcome back to Outlast 2. As you can see, we're not in a very stable place right now, in the mines, but they're falling all around us. Um, we're literally off the back of finding some startling revelations about what actually happened to Jessica. Uh, it's really, really bad stuff. Um, I don't even feel comfortable repeating it out loud, but uh, basically, she did not take her own life. She was uh, murdered, and worse, by a vicar, I believe, or a father. Um, that's came to light, and now... We're trying to escape the mines, I guess, because we're being chased by, by the muddy woman. I can't remember what her name is. I think it's Val. I've seen that name come up in a few uh, notes. But she blew some, like, pixie dust into our face, and that gave us the flashback where we realised what had actually happened to uh, Jessica. Now, we don't know if Blake has repressed these memories, or... Well, we don't know. Hopefully there'll be some revelations a bit later. Oh! Bloody wood. So now, I guess we're just working on getting out. Fuck! Fuck! Lynn. Okay, who's that? Oh, it's Lynn! Lynn. Lynn. That's not really Lynn, is it? No. Can't be Lynn. She's covered in mud as well. Oh How? shit, she is. Are you pregnant? Please. I don't want to die here. I don't want our baby to die here. Oh my I god. Won't. I won't let them kill you. Oh baby. Well, at least that mud's going to do great things for your skin. We have to get out of here. How on earth did you get pregnant? Oh no, what's going on now? Well, at least it's not raining blood. Seems like Slayer took the night off at last. But now, what is high winds? Is this dust? I'm not too sure. Um, can we look at what we just recorded there? Oh, is that the moon? What have we got to say about this? We're out. I got Jessica out. It was cold, but the snow had just started. Oh, it's snow. We'll find a grown-up and we'll tell them what happened. We'll be okay. We'll find a grown-up? The language Blake uses in some of these recordings, he's really unsettled, isn't he? So was he talking about Jessica in there as well? Like, did he revert back to being a child? I have no idea. Interesting. Shit, where should we go? How about through here? Oh, I hope there's no baddies. Um, this looks a bit precarious. Probably not meant to walk on this edge. Nope, it's been a very wrong way. Oh, we can run. Okay, seems there's a slant downwards here. Oh, don't like it. Our oh, vision is very impaired. There's this damn snow. I mean, I've said it a few times, but I'm really confused. I thought this was meant to be in, in the Arizona desert. I might just sound like an idiot saying that. Whoa! I guess we head towards the explosion. Is that lightning? As far from those places we can get. Yeah. Oh. You know what? I wouldn't even worry about shelter. I'll just keep going. I don't like this angle. Lynn's head keeps coming into frame. It's throwing me off. No, nope, that's no better. Okay, we'll follow this dastardly path. There's a barrel. Can we hide in that? Oh! Shit, we should have looked up. Okay. Going down, I guess. Down here. We have to get inside before the baby comes. It's too dangerous. You can't. We can't stay out here. Help me down, please, Blake. Oh shit. Okay. Okay. I got a feeling we're about to Be witness careful. a birth. What? Oh bollocks. Lynn. You okay? I'm coming down. Oh, it hurts. I'm sorry. Oh my god, that is not good. I think I'm just going to state the obvious in this video. That's not good. This is pretty bad. Things could be better. I need to lie down. Okay, Get there's a, a nice mattress there. I haven't checked it for lice, but I don't know, not, maybe you'll be all right. Okay. Okay. I just. It's going to be okay. Breathe. At least we're getting it on camera. Make a nice memory. Oh fuck. Shit. Come on. Oh shit, it's the axe lady. Bollocks. 
Um. Oh shit. Piss off. Oh Jesus Christ! Indeed. Oh. Can we crouch? We can't crouch. Oh. Bollocks. Bollocksy. Okay, lie down again. Where left do we go? I can't see anywhere to go. Shit. Oh, we go here. Fine. We got this, Lynn. Me and you. Together forever. Right. Let's go out here. What happened to these houses? Where has she been all this time? How did she know we were there? So many questions. Not enough answers. Oh crap. We're just going to run straight into her. I know we are. <laughs> Called it. Lightning's going to hit her. Lightning's going to hit her. Wait, did he mean to fall? He's gonna hit the, the pickaxe. Whoa! That's cooler than lightning. Yes! She's dead. Now, did someone throw that or did it just fall? Was that JC? <laughs> I bet it was. <laughs> oh my god, thank god. Well done, JC. New count on you. Can we take this? Guess not. Did it come from the top of there? Alright. Keep on moving, I guess. We'll get you out here, Lynn. Oh, it's our shadow. Bloody hell. Oh. Is this the right way? Feels kind of like a path. It is. Hurry. We'll find shelter. Oh, I just realised. It's not snow. In when he when we reviewed the footage, it's just him. He's literally reverted back to his child. Because it's snowing in the school area, isn't it? So I don't know what this is. This is just high winds, maybe. Definitely gonna run straight into someone. Wonder if Father Noth will make an appearance. Oh shit. Oh shit. Blake. This is the baby. No. Yeah, she's coming soon. Of course it's the baby Blake. Come on. She? Did you say she's coming soon? How'd you know the sex? There! The chapel! We can take shelter! No, not the chapel. Okay, let's uh, record this wagon, I guess. It's overturned wagon. Be great when we look back on all the nice memories we had here. Hey, remember the wagon? <laughs> I do. What you got to say about the wagon? The world was on fire. The baby was coming. The impossible child. Lynn said Jess was like her little sister. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. None of this is my fault. Yeah, I, I, I mean, I don't think it's your fault. What happened to Jessica? Uh, it's probably more we need to find out. I mean, judging from what we've seen, it's not your fault. You're a kid. What are you meant to do? You're probably terrified. I mean, that father was obviously a very manipulative bastard. And he preyed on children's, I don't know, fears, naivety, innocence. Don't worry, Blake. I think he needs to come to some sort of uh, acceptance. Oh, shit. Where do we go? Where's the chapel? Up here. At least our battery is, uh, I don't know, we've got some extra life ones in there this time? I don't know. It's been going for ages. Come on, we have to get inside. Oh, I quite liked it out in the open. <laughs> oh shit. Oh yeah, I remember this place. Oh, where's the bodies gone? Oh, he's still there. But Mary's gone. Oh no, she's gonna give birth on the stretch of oh, thing. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. You need to lie down. I can't do this. You can. You can do this. Oh god. Come on, Lynn. Just keep breathing. 
feels like something's wrong. Whoa, hold on, if I'm prepared for this. Ah! It hurts too much. I know, baby, I know. But you can do this, okay? Just keep breathing. Oh, crap. Oh, oh bloody hell. Oh shit! Oh look at it! <laughs> it's a baby! Well, well that's a new one. I don't think that's been done in a game before. You gotta cut the umbilical cord. Oh Jesus God! No! She lost too much blood! Fuck. Come on, Lynn. She did lose a lot of blood, didn't she? Lynn? There's someone going to be behind us, aren't they? Oh my god. This is some terrible stuff. Holy shit. This is so weird. Gotta admit, I don't really know what to say. Well, they pushed the boundaries a bit, didn't they? We haven't even kissed her yet. What? Like in Beauty and the Beast? Oh, you mean drama. The play. We're saving for the, like, actual night. Uh-huh. We are. Okay. We like cheek kiss. So like, is she your girlfriend? Tell me, or else, or else what? We tickle ya. I can't bear being tickled. I don't know how he feels. I got you again. That's enough. That's the child, isn't it? I didn't care how my children, but yours, I am powerless again. The child's too strong already. You've murdered paradise. What are you on about? Put that knife away, Noth. God has got silent. The birth. Who will he have if he destroys us all? Who will he have left to punish? I killed my children. All of them. Every last one. There's no more perfect faith than that. You're so deluded. It's still. If you can, if you love anything no. at all, crush its skull under your heel. No. I know God doesn't hear dead men, but I expect he's gonna kill himself. Them. Yeah. What the fuck is going on? Get your blood away from our baby. I mean, did he even reach his throat for all that fat? Right, so that's the axe lady, Lynn and Noth, dead within the space of five minutes. What the hell? Have we got our baby? We have. No more. Oh, we can still record. Jesus. Okay. Poor Lynn. Stupid Noth. His death was a little anticlimactic. It wasn't very satisfying, I've got to admit. The ex ladies was more. What are you saying about this one? The priest dies. You didn't have to do anything. You were a child. Nobody could expect anything of you. None of this is my fault. Yeah, he's definitely talking about the, uh, the time of Jessica. And he, he's right. He's not to blame. It's the father who's to blame. I mean, think how scary that is for both Blake and Jess. 
So it doesn't bear thinking about, does it? Right, we, is this done? Can we get out of here? Oh, can we take this with us, actually? I love that. Awesome poster. Is that the angels singing? What happened to the mud lady? She didn't die, did she? Was she trapped on the ground? There's a lot of flies. Oh, goodness. How's the baby doing? Okay, yeah, she's asleep. It is a she, right? Or did Lynn say there's nothing there? Is that pointing to what I think she's on about? Oh, wow. A crucifix up there. Bloody hell. So Laird and Nick are dead. Is only the, the muddy woman of all our uh, antagonists who's maybe still alive? God. What is this? Oh no, have they all like, uh, you know, killed themselves? Has it been a weird cult pact thing? She's gonna be okay. You have her. She'll get to grow up. She'll do everything she was born to do. I think they have. I think everyone's took their own lives. More insanity. I'm not gonna look down that well again, actually. Get up on here? No. Oh crap. Oh no, the sun! Get away! Get out of it! Oh shit. Hey Blake. <laughs> Try to find me. <laughs> oh fuck. One last school moment to torment me. Where are you? Where the shit are you? Oh god. Oh, oh no. Don't worry. But she has got rope marks on her face. Did the father then make it look like she hung herself? I'll never let you go. You never let me go. Now the light has gone away. Savior, listen while I pray. Begging thee to watch and keep, and send me quietly to sleep. Watchful Savior, wash away all I've been wrong today. Help me every day to be gentle, gentle, more like thee. And that's it. Outlast 2, everyone. We did it. We made it through. Now, I suppose, like most of my finished Let's Plays, I'll try and do some uh, off the cuffs, um, off the cuff final thoughts on what I thought of the game as a whole. Um, I did enjoy it, definitely. Bearing in mind as I only got like 15 minutes or so into the first Outlast, I'm quite pleased that I managed to see this through to the end. Believe me, I was terrified, um, which is one of the um, criticisms I've heard from other people, they don't find it as scary. But I suppose that's a very subjective um, uh, critique, I guess. I scare very easily and I thought the tension, especially in the school moments, were very uh, palpable, so yeah, I was very scared. Um, the gameplay, I mean, at first I was really into it, I've got to admit, I was super into it, uh, but you did see I've died quite a lot, it did become kind of trial and error-ish, it didn't seem like there was much in the way of stealth, I mean, most of the time I made it out of situations just by sprinting, running away, there was a few moments where I did actually have to hide, um, pushing the cart from the axe lady springs to mind, now, that could be something that is, um, I don't know, changed when you play on high difficulties. We did only play on normal. And I know it goes like hard, insane, all that sort of stuff. So there is that. But to be honest with you, I don't feel compelled to give it a second playthrough to, to find that out. Um, I feel a little bit burnt by the ending right now. I don't like how Noth just, I don't know, died. Uh, I mean, Lynn, I suppose, yeah. Makes sense that she'd have to die. It seems like that sort of game after all that. I don't know, it just felt a bit... Wanting more, it felt like it's something that will be expanded on in DLC. I'm assuming there's going to be DLC for this game because there was notable DLC for the first Outlast, Whistleblower, I think it was called. But it may be a completely separate story. One thought I've I've had is that um, any Outlast 2 DLC would follow Lynn's path throughout this game because I don't reckon she was captured the whole time. I reckon she escaped a few times, stuff like that, like at the start. But yeah, I mean the game looks beautiful. 
It really did. Really, really great looking game. The way they played with lighting and stuff like that. Um, it was good. I'm really glad I played it. I suppose which is the most important thing. I'm really glad I made a series out of it. Uh, will I play the DLC? Probably. Depending what it is. I mean, there's some very disturbing images in this game. Or very disturbing, I don't know, scenarios. Like that birth, I couldn't believe that. Jesus. But yeah, it was a lot of fun. So I guess without rambling, for, rambling on for too long, I should leave it there. Um, I'd just like to say a very big thank you to everyone who's ever taken the time to check this series out. When a game scares you as much as this does, it, it's great to see it get a good reception. It makes it all worth it. I really do appreciate it. Um, you investing your time into these videos. Um, if you did enjoy it, go ahead and leave a like. Like always, it helps out a great deal, and I really do appreciate it. If you want to see more, we've still got some uh, other Let's Plays on the go. Go ahead and subscribe, and I'll bring them to you. If you've got any questions, what are your thoughts about the end of the game, or the game as a whole, anything at all, leave a comment below, and I'll make sure I get back to you. Alright? See you!